This episode is sponsored by Your Perfect Getaway by Brittany Watson. Plan your perfect getaway today. Good morning, everyone. It is day three. It's crazy fast. On Mariner of the Seas. It is zooming by. And today is ship tour day. Ship tour day. It's very ship early. tour day. It's very it's early. Uh, we are really excited. We haven't seen a lot of this ship because yesterday was Coco K. We weren't on the ship. And uh, it was so busy on day one that we didn't get to see a lot of things. So we're really excited to see all the top decks and all the fun stuff and show you guys what we've seen. It's just amazing. So Can't wait to see it. let's start at the top and work our way down. Let's go. Ship tour day. Mariner of the Seas. Here we go. Ready? Let's go. All right. We are starting our ship tour today all the way at the top of the ship. We like to start at the top and work our way down. There are 15 total decks on the Mariner of the Seas. And on deck 15 at the aft of the ship, you will find the Puzzle Break Center. It's going to be the escape room on board. It looks super neat. One of these days we're gonna get in there and try it. It looks so awesome. All right, we're now on deck 14, still at the aft of the ship. And the very first thing you'll find here is the suite lounge. So if you are in a suite level cabin, you can come over here, check it out. How awesome, we're not in a suite level, but if you are, definitely come check it out. All right, one of the coolest things on deck 14 is this amazing observation lounge area. It's called Ellington's. Let's go check out the view. It is absolutely spectacular. is there an amazing observation area here. You get the best view of the ship. There's also a dance floor, so come dance it up. We have now traveled down to deck 13 and on deck 13, are you ready? You have the sports court, which <laughs> you have your flow rider. You have the perfect storm water slides and you have the sky pad. What is the sky pad? We're gonna show you, but jump, jump, jump around. <laughs> on the sports court. This is gonna be your basketball court area. They also have a lot of other things going on up here. Check your times, guys. This is really cool. Basketball on a cruise ship. What? We're shooting hoop. It's good. <laughs> they also have an amazing climbing thing for kids and adults. I love it. This area just keeps getting cooler and cooler. They even have swings that you can swing on. Ah, this is the life. Just swinging. It's beautiful. I love it. Let's keep swinging. Oh wait, we have a ship tour to do. Dang, I'll be back. You know what else they have back here in the sports court? Hammocks. Pardon me while I take a nap. Oh, that's right, we have a ship tour to do. I will definitely be back. Swings, hammocks. I need to rest back here all day. I am loving this sports court. You know what's up next? The Flow Rider. If you've ever been scared of the flow rider, if you've ever been nervous about doing it, don't be. It's really, really fun. I did it on Navigator. We're gonna try to do it again today. It's just really, really fun. They will help you through the entire thing. Give it a try. It's awesome. Moving right 
right along on the sports court, you will find the perfect storm water slides. There are two of them, and they look like so much fun. You gotta come check them out. I mean, why not? All right, the very last thing on the sports court you will find and it's the most amazing thing ever. It's called the Sky Pad. It is a trampoline where you're hooked on a bungee so you get to go super, super high. We are so excited to try this. It's something new that we've never seen before. I cannot wait. I just can't wait. So we'll tell you how it is. I love it. If you thought there were a lot of sporty things going on, don't miss out on the rock wall. I mean, sports, 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 sports. If this is too much adrenaline for you, that's okay. We're gonna go check out the rest of Deck 13. It gets a little bit more quieter, a little bit more softer. Let's go check it out. Play a few rounds at the Mariner Dunes. It's so fun. Another really cool thing you will find on deck 13 right next to the Mariner Dunes golf course is going to be a public sun deck. There are a ton of loungers up here. There's a water feature to cool off. I love that. So if you're looking for a place to kind of chill and hang out, this is the place to come. We are now on deck 12 and we are still at the front of the ship, right underneath the Mariner Dunes golf course. And here you will find the spa and fitness center. You can come here, book all your massage treatments, your facials, all that stuff, and work off a few pounds that you gained on your cruise. You can do all of that here on deck 12 at the spa and fitness center. As you can see, we are back outside on deck 12. Right outside the spa and fitness center, you will find the jogging track. So come get your jog on. There's also a ton of seating on this deck. I mean, sun deck, you gotta get your sun on. Also on deck 12, you will find the Sky Lounge. This is going to be a fantastic lounge above the pool deck. It has great seating here, a great view of the screen if you wanted to watch a movie, and you can watch all the pool activities. Grab a drink, grab a snack, watch the movie, go to the pool, do it all. Right above the Sky Lounge, there's another deck. It's a little bit higher up, it's one deck up. It is a beautiful sun deck, lots of seating, and the perfect place to watch the movie. If you were paying attention, we sat here on night one and watched the movie. It was the perfect ending to our perfect day.
right, we are now at the back of the ship. We're still in, on deck 12, and we are outside of all of the kids club area stuff. So your Adventure Ocean Kids Club, Fuel, the living room, all of that stuff, the nursery and the arcade are all here on deck 12 at the back. Johnny Rockets is also here. So let's go check that out and find out where that is. We are now on deck 11, and at the back of the ship, you will find the wind jammer, which is gonna be your buffet on board. It's gonna be breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and snacks, which is super, super awesome. You'll also find Jamie's Italian and Chops Grill here as well. So those are specialty dining restaurants with a little bit of an upcharge, but they're so yummy, you gotta come check them out. We are now outside on deck 11, and the very first thing you see before you get to the pool, you'll find the Arctic Zone frozen yogurt station. Come over here, grab your yogurt, enjoy the pool, and enjoy it all. All right, as you can see, we are on the funnest deck on the ship. This is the pool deck. It is on deck 11. There are two pools and four hot tubs and a movie screen and a pool bar and seating. I mean, what more could you ask for for the perfect sea day? All right, if you are looking for the ultimate relaxation and you're an adult, you need to come check out the solarium. It's an adult only area on board. It is for everyone, it's not private, and you can't hear anything. It's so perfect. There's a bar here, there's a pool here, lots of loungers. They're padded, they're really nice. There's even like day beds. You gotta come over here, check it out, and just relax and enjoy your cruise. Have you ever thought about getting dive certified? Well, you can do that on your cruise vacation. Here at the Patty Dive Center, they have everything for you to try it. There's even people in the pool today learning how to dive. That's really, really cool. I was reading all about it. Check your times guide in the excursion or go to the excursion desk. Find out all about the diving stuff here at Patty Dive Center. Right across from the Patty Dive Center, you will find Life Fest for the little ones who want to swim, who need a little bit of help. You will also find your towel station here as well. It's all on the pool deck, so just come over here, grab your towel, grab your Life Fest, and get to swimming. All right, we are right past the solarium. We're at the front of the ship now. We're on deck 11 still, and here you will find the second entrance to the spa and fitness center. This entrance is beautiful. I didn't even know there were two entrances to the spa, but that's really cool. So on deck 12 and deck 11, I love that. Come here, get all your massage treatments, and work out. Why not? That's good. All right, we've come to the end of all of our outside deck stuff. Really fun, right? This ship is so great. Now we're gonna skip all the cabin levels and go down to deck five and check out all the stuff that's inside the ship. There's so much more to see. All right, before we go down to deck five, we just found this deck and we didn't know this was here. It's on the very front of the ship. You go outside of deck 11. There's a little door right at the front, come out. There is a bunch of seating out here. You can look off the front of the bow of the ship. But the really cool thing about this is there's a little bridge viewing area with seating. There are windows that look down onto the bridge. That is super amazing. We've never seen that before. Very, very cool. If you're on Mariner of the Seas, definitely come check this out. Okay, we're now on deck five. And deck five is the start of all of your inside stuff. 
all the fun stuff's on deck five. We're gonna check it out in just a second, but first, we are standing in front of the main dining room on deck five. This is going to be one of the uh, seating times, so if you have a early seating or late seating, you're gonna come here on deck five, main dining room, love that. Right past the main dining room. Again, we're still on deck five. We haven't even got to the fun stuff. But before you get to the fun stuff, you will find guest services, and on the other side, you will find your shore excursion desk. Right next to the shore excursion desk, you will find next cruise. Here you can put a deposit down and book your very next cruise. I mean, you wanna go to Alaska? How cool is that? You wanna go to Australia? Yes, please. And don't forget that Odyssey of the Seas, the new quantum class ship is coming out to Fort Lauderdale. So you gotta come over here and book that as well. All right, we have now come to the most exciting place on deck five. This is the Royal Promenade. Here you will find shops. You will find the bamboo room. You will find the pub. You will find the Promenade Cafe and you will find Playmakers. Let's go explore all of those areas. I can't wait. Up first, you will find Port Merchants. This is where all you will find all of your duty-free stuff. You will also find sundries here like suntan lotion, snacks. So if you're looking for any of that stuff, come over here to Port Merchants. Right across from Port Merchants, you will find Regalia. This is going to be your high-end jewelry shop on Mariner of the Seas. Guess what time it is? It is tiki time. That's right. On the promenade, you will find the bamboo room. This is going to be a wonderful lounge. You can come over here and grab a wonderful drink. They, the mixologists over here are fantastic. You gotta come check it out and say hi to our friend Cliff. He's the parrot here. He pops up every now and again, but he's a hoot. Right across from the bamboo room, you will find the market. This is going to be your Royal Caribbean swag shop. So all of your Mariner of the Seas sweatshirts, keychains, magnets, all of that stuff can be found in here. You can also find the straps that we had on our glasses from Coco K yesterday in here. They're really cheap, goodbye, we love them. Uh, they have other things like purses and bathing suits and all that stuff. You gotta come look at it, it's really, really cool. The market on the promenade. Moving right along on our Royal Promenade extravaganza, you will find the Barnacle and Barrel Pub. This is going to be your pub on board, so come over here, grab a pint, listen to the guitar player. It's an amazing way to end your evening. Right across from the Barnacle and Barrel, you will find Solera. This is going to be your beauty shop on board, so all of your perfume, your makeup, all that stuff, you can find it here. We have a lot of people ask us about the soda machines on board. You will find two on the promenade. It's a great location, centrally located, really easy. Grab your mugs and come on and grab a soda. All right, right behind me, you will find the Cafe Promenade. The Cafe Promenade is a really cool place to hang out. They have specialty coffee drinks. They have Ben and Jerry's ice cream. Those are all gonna be a small upcharge, but they also have complimentary snacks. So they have pizza, they have sandwiches, they have danishes, all that stuff depending on what time of day it is. And they also have complimentary coffee as well. So if you don't want a specialty coffee, go to the end of the Promenade Cafe and grab yourself a cup of joe. Right across from Cafe Promenade, you will find Playmakers. This is going to be your sports pub on board. Here you can watch all of your favorite sports. They had all the games on last night. It's really, really cool. We also have got wings here. You get wings, burgers, fries. You gotta come try it. It's really, really good. It is a small upcharge, but definitely worth it. Come over here to Playmakers and enjoy all your sports. All right, that's the Royal Promenade on deck five. How cool is that? You gotta come see it. There's one last thing on deck five. Let's go check it out. Okay, the very last thing you will find on Deck 5 is the Star Lounge. It is a fantastic small venue entertainment area. I love that. They have game shows here. They have all kinds of things going on. Check your times guide to find out what's going on here. So many things. They had rock Rocky here last night. I mean, so much going on. I love it. And when I space out, I see the possibilities unfolding the way that I want. Okay, we are now on deck four, 
And at the start of deck four, you will find the Royal Theater. The Royal Theater has two entrances, one on deck four, one on deck three. This is where all of your production shows are going to be, so you gotta check your times guide. So many things going on. I mean, there's comedians, there's jugglers, there's magicians, all that fun stuff you'll find in the Royal Theater. Right past the Royal Theater, you will find Izumi. This is going to be your hibachi, teppanyaki, and sushi restaurant on board. It's amazing, lots of tables. I mean, what more could you ask for? Right across from Izumi, still on deck four, you'll find the Schooner Bar. This is a fantastic nautical themed bar with all kinds of things going on. They have trivia, they have a really nice lounge area, and they have a piano player here at night, so you gotta come check it out. Check your times guides for all the things going on here. I love it. The one thing I absolutely love about the Schooner Bar are these portholes. You get to grab a cocktail and watch the ocean go by. Well, in this case, watch Nassau, but you get to watch outside. I absolutely love that. Right past the Schooner Bar, again, we are still on deck four. You will find the Casino Royale. You guys know what you do in there. Come over here and get your game on. Right, right past the Casino Royale. Get your dancing shoes on, cause you'll come to Boleros. This is going to be your Latin dancing club on board. They have a dance floor, they have a band. They also have a really nice bar here as well. You gotta come check it out, I love it. Okay, right across from Boleros, you'll find this. Everybody knows what this means. Yes, there's Starbucks on Mariner of the Seas. So come over here, grab your specialty coffee, your Starbucks snacks, all those things you enjoy on land, you have on the ship. All right, we've come to the end of deck four. And at the end of deck four, you will find another dining room. Remember, there are three dining rooms on Mariner of the Seas. This is dining room number two on deck four. This is going to be a dining room for your set seating. So if you have early or late seating, you would come to deck four. All right, we've now traveled down to deck three, and on deck three, you will find the third and final dining room. This is going to be your anytime dining room. They also serve breakfast here in the, in the morning, and they are doing the Cali brunch. Let's sneak in and see if we can get some shots. Okay, they are setting up for the Bottomless Galley Brunch. We did the Bottomless Galley Brunch on the Harmony of the Seas. If you wanna check that out, check out our video, the link is below. It is such a great thing to try. They take you behind the scenes of the kitchen and then you have the most fantastic brunch ever in every kind of food you could possibly imagine. Definitely recommend it, definitely check it out if you're interested. Look at that, we are now in focus, the photo gallery on board Mariner of the Seas, and all of your pictures are all electronic, so come over here, check out all the cool things that you've done on your vacation from the amazing photographers on board. All right, right past the photo gallery, you will find Studio B. This is gonna be the onboard ice rink. Do you hear that? It's an ice rink. They have ice shows here. They have an ice show called Under the Big Top, which we're gonna go see tonight. I'm really excited. And they also have public skate as well. You need to have long pants and socks if you wanna participate in the ice skating, but it's so cool, you gotta come try it. Would you believe that we have come to the very final end of our ship tour and we are ending it on deck three in front of the Royal Theater. Remember I told you there are two entrances, there's one on four and there's one on three. We're standing on deck three. This is the Royal Theater. Check your times guide for all the things going on. So much, all the time, the ship never sleeps.
<laughs> Alrighty. Alright, that's our whole ship tour. The entire tour. Mariner of the Seas, we hope you've enjoyed it as much as us. We love this ship. We love it. Now we have so much more to do today. Like, let's keep going. The fun doesn't stop now. There's way too much to do. Let's go. Let's go. Ah. Okay. Good, Good afternoon. Morning. morning. Good afternoon. It's 1040. <sighs> It's, it's a little Good early. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> we had the best ship tour. Mm -hmm. So awesome to see this ship from top to bottom. It was just wonderful. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well. Uh, we had breakfast at the Windjammer which was fantastic, wasn't it? So, so good. So, so good. Great food. Loved it. And now our backs and knees are feeling the ship tour. So we are going to uh, take it up into the hot tub because we tub. are going to do that. So next stop, hot tub. Here we go. Bye. We're in the hot tub. It's lovely. In the solarium, which is very nice. Very nice. It's covered. I like that. Mm -hmm. It feels really good on my feet. My feet are hurting. <laughs> All the stairs yesterday at Coco Cay and then All chip the stairs today. Yeah. This is lovely. Can I love it? I love it. I love it. Dive. So oh. <laughs> All right, guys. We had just had the best time in the hot tub. It was so, so great. Oh my gosh. So relaxing. My legs feel so much better. And you know why they feel much better? Because we're about to go do the sky pad. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, there aren't any rules for it. Like, I was looking sure to see if you have to wear socks rules. or something. So as of, at this point, I don't know. But we are going with the key. The key. So let's go do that. Um, I'm so excited. Let's go. I think we're going to get lunch first. Grab a little something, something. And then we're going to the sky pad. Stay tuned. Let's go. Here we go. everyone. Good evening everybody. It is night three. This is going insanely fast. Oh my gosh. These four days. So Oof. fast. But we had the best day. It was so much fun. We had the best ship tour. Mm -hmm. Hope you guys liked it because it was awesome. We loved it. Fun. Had so much fun making every going to every location. We just love it. It's just mm -hmm. fun. Um, and then we did the sky pad which is very very fun. That's I do cool. have some bruises on my arms so keep that in mind if you are interested in doing that. Maybe wear long sleeves, but they might rip because the bungee cords were rubbing against my arms, so I have some bruising. But she also held on for dear life. I did. I was so scared. <laughs> Let it be known. <laughs> but it was so fun. Mm -hmm. Loved it. And Super now cool. we are going to the ice show under the big top. So let's go mm -hmm. do that. And uh, then we have dinner plans. Yeah, yeah. Well, we don't know. We'll find everything to do, but it's so great. So let's great. go. Ready? Let's do it. I'm go. So ready. Let's, let's go. go. Come on.
summer's gone, I'm latching on Don't even know your name, but you're still in my head Underneath rays of gold, your body all so close No, I can't forget, no When I saw you on the dance floor All right, we're about to watch Under the Big Town Oh yeah Looks so fun, it's an ice skating extravaganza Here we go Girl, you should wear a name tag. Cause all I wanna do is to know your name. Girl, you should wear a name tag. That's the only way that I can show you. what tomorrow is okay. no happy halloween happy halloween happy halloween ween i cook okay with bats Ooh, the ugly bug halloween ball whoa all right day three is in the books it is over and it was such a fantastic day a very busy day as you have just seen but so much fun from the shiv tort this morning to the sky pad um then we watched the show uh the ice skating show which we definitely recommend there were two showings on our cruise so maybe there'll be two showings on your cruise but definitely check that out if you can and then we had finished off our entire day with an impromptu meal at chops grill which is the perfect treat to ourselves to uh you know just we absolutely love dinner time and especially dining for us is just an absolutely romantic fun evening and we just love it so that was a great ending um we are going to bed tonight because we are exhausted actually it's late it's like 11 o'clock but uh tomorrow we are at coco k and it's halloween halloween mean so uh good night for tonight a very special thank you to our sponsor your perfect getaway by Brittany watson thank you so much for this opportunity it's been absolutely wonderful we can't wait to finish it off tomorrow with halloween we are so excited we have our costumes ready i mean we're just ready we just can't wait it's so awesome we're so excited um thank you guys so much for watching we will see you tomorrow good night for tonight bye it's really yucky, it's really yucky. <laughs> Moving right along in the sports court, on the sports court, somewhere on the sports court. Get it right, Steph. Oh. All right, are you trying to do? <sighs> so was the sports court a little too thrilling? You can bring it down a few notches and try your hand at a few putts of. A few putts of golf, everyone.
Another thing you will find on deck 12 is the Sky Lounge. This is going to be an upper deck part of your, for your I shouldn't say upper deck. Probably not. Okay, also on, I'm just gonna, I need to, oh, sorry. Right across from the Dabby, Dabby. <laughs> Right across from the patty dives there. Okay, we are now on deck five, and on deck five, this is where most of your stuff is gonna be. Let's do that again, because that wasn't very good. Right next. Sure. Oh, <laughs> That's good stuff in here. You will also find sun, 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 sun. <laughs> yeah, come, come here. Come, come something. Okay, we are still moving right along on the Royal Promenade, and up next you will find the Barnacle and Barrel. Bar barnacle and Barrel? Why is <laughs> Right across from the Barnacle and Barrel, you will find Solera. This is going to be all of your beauty pop prop. Beauty. A lot of. Okay, we are now on deck, we have to wait. Right past the Royal Theater, you will find Izumi. This is going to be your hibachi, your teppanyaki, and sushi. Right next to Izumi, still on deck four, you will find the Schooner Bar. This is a fantastic nautical theme bar. They have things like uh, game stuff, they have game show stuff, all kinds of things going on. Probably should start that again. All right, right past the casino. No, I thought this is the casino. This is the casino. Deck four, and at the end of deck four, you will find the, the other main dining room on... <laughs> I see you back there. I see you. Myself. <laughs> Windjammer. Our buffet it was fantastic. Win Jimmy. Win Jimmy. And no, the gimbal was so close. This episode is sponsored by Your Perfect Getaway by Brittany Watson. Plan your perfect getaway today. Win Jimmy. Win Jimmy. And no, the gimbal. <laughs>